audience with profits, a little extra money, to take the next step and the next step. It's a building process. And so the steps that took you to where you get finally aren't necessarily failures. They're only failures if they attempt and they totally go away and don't really make anything. Failures on the, the way to starting a company, you're young entrepreneurs. No, you don't, you don't really care that much. For you, it's usually a love and a passion inside of you. You write a little program. Maybe it doesn't affect the world. Maybe it doesn't make $10, but it's a learning step in your head that you feel proud about and that takes you to the next step. Motivation is more important than knowledge. Great. And, and with this role of technology, the, the advantage that we have to have so much access, you know, uh, today you can have a sales force for a couple of bucks a month and you have a full ERP system. Uh, but at the same time, it feels like technology, better yet, do you think we control technology or does, control, does, does technology control us? Well, when I think of technology and humans, I go, well, Apple has had a big role in this whole area. And we were largely influenced by a very intellectual guy, university professor of classical music, Jeff Raskin, who came and taught Steve and I, you can either make people struggle to learn how to use the technology, and then a few technology experts know how to use computers, or you can work hard as a company making a product, you make it work and work and work in the way that people are already familiar with working. And that makes the human being the master and not the technology. So Apple we've had a strong influence to make our products easier to use, to make them more understandable. With the Macintosh, it was to make it intuitive. You would just look at a screen and sort of know what you were supposed to do. That's because it was really based on how humans already do things. Um, you know, one step towards, for example, the big step we took was coming up with a computer with a GUI and a mouse-based pointing system. Well, the mouse-based pointing system, and we have to give a tribute to Doug Inglehart, who uh, just died, but the mouse-based system, your eye will see a TV screen. 